man, look at this guy over here, man. Writing tickets, bro. What are you doing? Look at this guy. What a hater right now. Look at that. Let me get a I'm getting a close up of him. Hater, bro. Uh -huh. He typing in what are you typing? He typing in the uh the Oh, there you go. Look at that. Look at that. Take a picture. Look, oh, they're gonna got right there. He's like, for real? <laughs> wow. He said, come here and talk about this, or you're gonna get two. Dang. What a Yo, man, what is going on, man? Welcome back to another video. It is your boy, Fat Cat, bringing you another one. Finally, another one, man. I know I've been off the map for a minute. <laughs> Yo, I was just telling him I've been off the map too, bro. I ain't been putting out nothing. <laughs> been off the map for a minute, man. A good, probably solid couple weeks now. But I've been working hard on my other channel, man, putting out literally three to four videos every single day on that other channel. But we here, man. Got my dude, Garage Driven, right here, of course. Coming through. He came through in the... Prius? Prius? What y'all know about that, it man? It cost me nothing to come here, man. <laughs> <laughs> Came through in the Prius. We got my got my youngest Noah back there, man, hanging out as well. Anyway, man, we about to do a couple work too. Christine, man, Sleeping Beauty. It's been about a good month and a half, almost two months since we turned this car on. So we're getting ready to get a nice little cold start yeah, for y'all. I, I got to get that. About to get a nice little cold start for y'all. And then we're going to, um, you know what I'm saying, do some work, man. So we got a couple things we got to put in. Uh, uh, you know, on her today. So that's why Paul came through, brought the soup bowl of tools. Soup bowls in the car. Man. <laughs> it's a traveling, traveling mechanic. <laughs> the mobile mechanic, bro. What y'all know about that? Yo. Hey, man. So first thing is first, man. Let me go over here. Got my trickle charge on here. Like I said, month, bro. If this would have been any other time, a month and a half, no. dead. 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 Hey, you know what? My car sat down there for two weeks. And I fired it up, it was like, shit, shit, this is boom. I was like, oh. oh. I was like, yeah. <laughs> hey, yo, the first place I thought about was you. Yeah. Like, oh. That would have been, bro. Like I said, me? Yo, son, you wild. Look at this shit. What the fuck? Oh, uh, bro. Leave the roof up, though? I guess just for the different event. Yeah, I always leave the roof open. So what is that? So what I'm is it? trying to go oh, up that's, and live. That must be like a cobweb, bro. And he's trying to go live in, inside the whip. So. <laughs> they probably in there. They're probably in there. Yeah, I've never been in there for two, I haven't been in there for two months, so. They might be in there for real, for real. That's crazy. Let me put this down somewhere. Yeah, what's going on, guys? Oh, let me take this off. So we got my trickle charger. Boom. Boom. Take that off. All right, we done with that. Put this down. We got here. Hey, we in the building, baby. What's Been good? Long. What's right. going on, man? Make sure y'all suck to his channel. Yes, sir. But, um, yo, so I was looking at this just now. <laughs> yo, why you got a roof open for two months? <laughs> what is that? I might have, yo, I might have like little creatures in here. I don't know. Yeah, they in there, bro. I'm kind of scared to get in. But you know what? I think you got the shade closed, though, so I'm. Yeah, yeah, shade's closed. So he just took off his, his little trickle chalk. I might need to invest in his knees. My car was almost dead the other day. Yeah, I mean, it was probably the best. Well, mine, I got the full amp, so mine was like 70 bucks. And, bro, best thing I've ever done. Yo, this car is still clean right now, and it's been two months. It looks good, though, still. You know what I mean? Yeah, 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 yeah. You yeah, do anything, yeah. but you got a nice moment there. You know what I mean? Yeah, it's been literally almost yo. two months. And, like I said, I haven't even touched this car, man. I haven't yo. washed it, I haven't done nothing. Yo, 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 my opinion. I think the Arturo. Is a better looking tire than the Pirelli. I'm talking like side wall and stuff. Oh like yeah, that. yeah. Then the Pirelli, yeah, yeah, for sure. Yeah, I, I think so, man. I just like the way that that Toro just be looking, man. Something about that tire, man. I'm telling y'all. Yeah, the Toro for sure looks better. Yeah, you know, they, 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 they work good. They, they grip. I like them. Yeah. I like them. Appreciate that plug. Oh you know yeah, 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 yeah. I already plugged it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, appreciate that plug. I forgot about that. Because I was getting ready to get some more either uh, 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 Pirellis or something like that. I'll go with the Nittles. And he was like, yo, try the Arturos, man. So, if y'all anything like me, man, you know, you guys are, you know, brainwashed by the big companies and everything else. Yeah. And I was just like, nah, man, I got to get like the name brand, name brand, Nitto, da, da, da. He was like, nah, man, get the Arturo. So I was like, all right, man, I fuck it. I'm going I'm to I'm I'm mess with it, see what it is. And like I said, they've been doing me good. I haven't had no issues with rain. Four and change? Four sets? Something like that, yeah, yeah. yeah. 
No, no, no issues on rain or nothing, man. Yeah. So, yeah. you know what I'm saying? I so, I was going to play some runs. And you're on my, um, so my new setup with my wide body wheels, I'm running them again. Mm. But now I'm running the 315s all the way around. All the way around. So, you know, the wide body come 305. Mm -hmm. I went ahead and put 30, um, 315 instead. Okay. Just Dang. because 305, they you can't get the 305s. Right. You know what I mean? So it's like, I'm not spending 1200 bucks in tires and let's just eat up like that with these cars. Like, nah, man. Yeah. If anybody else want to do that, man, teach his own. You guys want to <laughs> enjoy it? Like, yo, I rock my 315s, man. It, it looks good. Yo, it's going to look real good. So you guys wait till that setup is done. I'm telling y'all, yo, I know what I'm doing. <laughs> mm. So here I go, man. So we about to get it in right now. Oh, by the way. Get y'all fat cat merch, man. Look at that. Fat cat oh, yeah, yeah, merch. Yeah, that, get that bro, get that bro. fat cat merch yeah. at the Teespring yeah. store. Link is in the description right now, man. Make sure y'all go in the description. You know, well, link to that and get that merch. What up? No, I ain't put my merch out yet, though. But I did have my sample come in. I didn't even wear it today, bro. Yeah. <laughs> what you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? For Dodge. Hey. Dodge ain't give me nothing. Noah, hit him with the face. <laughs> 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 hey yo man, here we all go man. Hey y'all ready? After a month and a half, almost two months, here y'all go man. Co-start of Christine man. Let's go. Here we go. There we go, man. Can so, yes, back in the interview. That's the only thing, yeah, I don't got my, that's really the only reason I'm not driving it really right now. Yeah. So I got all the caps back, as y'all can see, man, as y'all know before. Got the, uh, all the caps back, the radiator cap and all that. Mm. Yep. So I'm just waiting for all my other stuff. Yep. Got the windshield wiper fluid as well. I'm waiting for all my other stuff, man. All the other stuff that you see that's off of the car or off of the engine bay, man. He's supposed to be dipping in another theme, but again, Tono Garage, shout out to Tono the Garage, but he's been dealing with some humidity up there, which doesn't let the clear coat like seal properly. Oh, also, that's the issue. So yeah, yeah. Basically, once he's trying to like dip it or whatever the case, and start dry. he could dip it and he could he could he could uh, coat it, uh, uh, you know, with clear coat. Yeah. But then, like the next day, like it come, like it's like peeling or something from that humidity. He called like what was going on. He called the company, yeah. and he was like, they were like, oh, you got a lot of humidity right now. And he was like, yeah. He was like, oh yeah, that's what it is. So for all your people that be dipping. There y'all go, man. Can't dip right now in the heat. The heat, the humidity, all that. You know, I came out clean, bro. Like, yeah, I like it. You know, he always do good work, and then, and then he only, you know, what I'm saying, then it's only the top part. So look, that's just still, yeah. Yeah. So, you know, what I'm saying that's what all of them. So that way, you know, you don't make sure none yeah, of that I'm stuff is getting inside the mold. Get inside, right? Yeah. So that makes sense. All right, man. So what we're gonna do today? Actually, we're gonna do a few things, man. But yeah. for right now, we're gonna do the intake. This is we're gonna do my true carbon fiber intake with uh uh um man why am I forgetting the company? Oh uh, leg maker. Leg maker. 
true cold true air intake. True intake because a lot of people, for some reason, they call cold air intakes now like they're short ram air. They're short one, yeah. That's and not, yeah. from my era, when I came up, when I was coming up, you know, back. This shit wasn't in the bumper? Yeah, like that's not a cold air intake. Like it's an intake, yeah, but it's not a cold air intake. Yeah. So for some reason, a lot of people call them the cold air intakes even like the short ram air. I don't know. I might have been out the game for too long. But anyway, I got the true cold air that goes all the way down into the bumper, man. So that's what we're going to do right now. And as you guys can see, so you got the vents and everything down there, man, which we pushing yeah. air to it. Uh -huh. And if this was a Hellcat, even better because then I won't have any fog lights. But with the with the bumper down there, as y'all can see, obviously there's, you don't know, nothing in there, right? whatever, right? So air is going to be going through and it should push you straight to my intake. That's why they call it cold air intake because it comes from the bottom straight to your intake, man. So anyway. Side markers, right? Yeah, and then we got the side markers. That might be a different video depending on how long it takes. Definitely. <laughs> oh, yeah. Gonna, you know, since this is a shorter, we're gonna do the video on the side markers in this one right here. I think that makes sense. This is a shorter install. Do what? And then do do the side markers on this video because we got. Oh, okay, I got, I got you. I got you. And then for the next video will be the cold intake, which is gonna be a long process. All right. You know what I, mean? I think that makes sense. So either way, so too we got too too long. So we got so we got that video all right because we already been watching it. So we yeah. got so we're gonna do that cold intake. We're also gonna do my side markers from. Uh, uh, Diamond Dynamics, man, who mentioned my, my boy, then got sponsored as well. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Yep. Sponsored product that came out from Biodynamics. And as y'all can see, obviously, I already have, you know what I'm saying, the ones from Amazon, the uh, the, the LED strips. But Biodynamics is the, obviously, we know, man, they are a superior company with that. That's what they do, man. They, they do light, man. That's what they do. They literally do LED lights. That is they thing. So I was like, yeah, man, hell yeah. They send me some out and I'll definitely uh, put it on my car. If y'all don't know, if y'all don't know, because Dial Dynamics is what I got inside here. So all of my lights inside here, all my interior lights and all that is uh, Dial Dynamics as well. You know what I'm saying? But y'all see the strip right there. It's a similar look, but you know. But like I said, it's, it's just, just, it's just yeah, better, right? Yeah, it's just yeah, better yeah, quality. It's not Amazon. So we're, what we're gonna do? We're gonna install it and then we're gonna do a comparison, so you guys can see. There you go. Yeah, we can do that. We're gonna, we're gonna see what the difference is between the two of them. They look any different, whatever the case. So. <laughs> Man's got the, the look at that mobile mechanic, man. Son, you gotta have a Daytona and a Daytona Jack. Look at this guy. <laughs> look at this guy. And did you get it green because your brakes used to be green? Nah, nah. Green. <laughs> you know what? What's crazy that when I bought it, I thought about it. I was like, damn, if I had green brakes, I would have yeah. <laughs> Oh, you bought this after? Yeah, I bought this shit after. Uh, I bought this one recently. My gray one kind of got a leak. Yo, infamous soup bowl of tools, yo. This 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 toolbox literally has done work for half of Central Florida. Yo, I should have wanted to make some shit happen today. Yo. <laughs> <laughs> damn, there I go, man. Look at that. Look, look, look at the back of the Prius, bro. Really practical. Yo, bro. With the seats down? I have my wheels, everything in there. For real? Yeah. Damn. That's crazy. This is the Dial Dynamics one we get ready to replace it with. And this is the one he just took off. The uh, the one that was on the car from Amazon. So, like I said, pretty much, they almost look the same, except this yeah. one is like more smoke than this one. Like this one's like a little bit darker. Yeah, so. exactly. That one has, this one has more of a shine too. I like that. Right. I like that how it was all black. All right, so what you want to do when you're installing these, I showed on one of my other videos, you want to thread it prior to putting it up in there. Because if you put it up in there right now, up in the wheel well, and you try and thread it, you're going to catch your ass doing it. Mm. So what you do, you take one of the screws, and you just thread both holes. That way you make the threads right now, once you put them on the car, it just goes it's right in. It just goes right in. Oh, yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, so that's what I'm going to do right now. I'm just going to have to thread it. Wanna make sure it's going in straight. See? Out of stripes. Mm -hmm. Cause the plastic is just raw plastic. Right, right, right. right. So. It, we're gonna just put it back up in there. There you go. Yo, so here goes the comparison. So we just did the front one over there where he just did the front one. And look, so this is the Amazon one right here. The Amazon joint. 
And then you walk over here and you got the dial dynamic joint. Now, you're probably not gonna be able to pick up on camera, yeah, but, but this one looks way better, man. Like, this one, <laughs> the, the line is just way better. And it's like, I don't know, it's like the, even like the way it lights up, mm -hmm. it just looks way better. It's like way cleaner. That looks dope. The other one's like, yeah, it's almost like. It's still, you know, now, you, now you notice how much light this one. Yeah, like, like it's too wide. much. Yeah, it's too, it's too wide. And it yeah. almost looks like distorted. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. It looks distorted almost. Like it's just like too much light bleeding through. Right? On camera, you probably can't really see yeah, it. You probably can't see it on camera. Like but that. when you look at it in person, like this line, the way that this lights up, the light, the way that this lights up, uh, uh, coming through the line right there, it's definitely way cleaner. Like the line is way cleaner. For sure. Yeah, that's definitely fun. But, I mean, if you're on a budget, like I was, because I wasn't trying to do no 400 something dollars with them uh, oracles, you know what I'm saying? That Amazon definitely works. But these are not as much. I think these are only about 100 bucks, maybe a little over 100 bucks uh, for the for the Dow Dynamics. Definitely worth it, man. Like these joints are way better, man. They definitely light up better than those Amazons. Paul just finished doing the uh, Dow Dynamic all the way across or all the way around, I should say. Joints look pretty dope. Look at the rears. Look at the rears. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that look pretty dope, man. Yeah, everything's done and installed. Rears. All the way around, man. So like I said, the light, you really can't tell inside the, uh, on the camera, but you know what I'm saying? The light just looks more crisp. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? And, and, and it like illuminates better. It's not, it don't like bleed where it's like everywhere. So it's pretty dope, man. So other than that, man, that's it for this video, man. Hey, I'm sorry it took me so long to bring out some more videos, man. But man, you know what I'm saying? Here working, working on my other channel and everything else, man. So, but we here though, uh, recording again. We're about to record another video for y'all. Damn, look how, how, look how hot it is over here, man. We over here in this humidity, Florida. Woo. What are we in? September? Almost about to hit October, man. Humidity's still high. Paul's in the Prius, man. No, I'm back there. My wife's car. So yeah, man. So other than that though, man, uh, we're gonna start, you know, I'm gonna record another video right now, man. So I'm gonna try to get back in the groove of things and recording things for this car. Like I said, I haven't been able to move it um, yet because again, my fuse box cover is still going. But I did tell Tony Garage, man, I told him that if you can't get it done by this week, to go ahead and send it back. So that way I can start moving around. And getting some more content for y'all, man, because I haven't even been able to do nothing. And you know what I'm saying? And it's, I know it's kind of, I know, actually, as a matter of fact, I, while, I, while I'm on the subject, I appreciate y'all who's been reaching out, man. It's been like, yo, what's going on? You good? That's not, you know what I'm saying? I miss your channel. I appreciate y'all that's been reaching out, man, and saying that I am good. It's just, again, I just really haven't been able to move my car, so I really haven't been able to get out there and do some content, you know what I'm saying? But Hopefully, if I get my, my, my cover back and everything else, man, we're going to start moving around, going to a couple of these meets and whatever not, and, and, and you know, give y'all some content. And on top of that, like I said, I still got some more things. I just checked to see if the Thought About It for the dude, because oh, okay, I'm still coming for you, too. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But the dude for the Thought About It, he's still not taking orders, man. So you know, I just checked like a couple of days ago, and he's still not taking orders. So we still got that coming. We still got the headers coming and everything else. He got something big going on right now with his car. For whatever reason, if you're not watching it, um, some of my subscribers, if you're still not watching him, bro, watch Garage Driven. Go subscribe to his channel, man, because he got a big project going on with his car. Yes, so uh, literally, it's gonna be it's gonna be one of one. One of one. I don't think nobody else is gonna have it. It's really gonna be one of one. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? When you break it all down, it'll be one yeah. on one. You know what I'm saying? But yeah. so make sure I go check out my man, Garage Driven. But we here, man. So we getting ready to start tackling this that intake now. leg maker intake. True coated intake, man. That's gonna be on the next video. So make sure y'all stay tuned, man. Like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff, man. Share with your family. Stay blessed, stay humble, stay motivated, stay true to yourself, and most importantly, stay genuine, man. Cause anything else will be on civilized, man. We out of here.